Meow. <laughs> oh. Uh, I, I recommend away. you shouldn't hit the koala. <laughs> it is very much an aggressive being. How do I get to it? How do I get... Oh my gosh. What is going on right now? You need engine shenanigans. Okay, well, I'm going to drive a car. So what am I doing? I'm trying to aggravate the thing you told me not to aggravate. Probably need to, like, I don't know, hit it. Okay, you ain't get the koala. Okay. Yeah, you died. <laughs> Press escape. No, his laser eyes. Still a cop. Okay. Oh, what have I done? You grabbed him. How did I grab him? If you dash at him, you, you grab him. <laughs> you prepared me long and hard like those 80s movies where they do montages. Oh my gosh, it's like uh, Voltron. <laughs> Doggo. Doggo, the boss. You have to take out one of the sheep legs. Oh, okay. Uh oh, I aim for the sheep and then you can face. attack the police cars. Oh, okay. So it's like a multi stage. And, and then you hit can, the weak points. And then. Yeah. You can take out one of the legs again. Okay. I feel like I have messed up. I have done messed up now. Oh. Do I have to hit it with my. I can't wait to try out Deer Simulator. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, welcome back. This is Protodead, and my son is going to show me how to play Deer Simulator. Hello. Hi. Vincent. Yeah, that's me, your son. Uh, that's me. Just so you know, this game is very weird. Is it going to blow our eardrums out when it starts? No. I hope it doesn't. I mean, the tile screen is already uh, weird, so... I'm you afraid. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's... Yeah, that's the, uh... <laughs> uh... Volume. How about we turn this down just for the recording, right? Yeah. Uh, does it save when I just hit escape? Sounds like it. Okay, so I just hit start, right? Yep. Why is the dex did the deer's neck like this? Because it's like that. Okay. What? Why man, would this... I create myself? I, I haven't played this game in like years, man. I I completely forgot about this. Okay. Hat. Yeah, hipster. I'll go hard hat. Okay, is there just a random button? What? A random button. Oh, random. Here we go. Done. Hey, he's got a Jordy LaForge eye thing. What's going on? I don't know. Is this new? Well, yeah. He saved me. <laughs> and he immediately dies. So you wasted your time making a character? Yep. I love it. Me too. Especially if somebody sat there and poured, like, much time into creating their character. Probably, like, a half a minute. Be reborn? Who wants to click no? No, you die. Okay, so we get to start over again. Yeah. Now right, you can press escape to skip. To skip the cutscene? Yeah. You're born. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I will select yes this time. How silly. How how absolutely goofy. What what absolute silliness this is. So you're reborn as a deer. Yep. Okay. A polygonal deer. Self sacrifice. Get hit by a truck. So I have three hearts. W A S and D to move around, and I can jump like the Dickens. What the hell? That is your, uh, basically a run ability. <laughs> the 
so so Deer Simulator is very much in the same vein of Goat Simulator. Yeah. And Goat Simulator was the first one, really, to do this sort of absolute zany bonkers. Yeah. Okay. So what, what, what am I doing here? Basically cause chaos and destruction. <laughs> what the, what is, I hit right click and my dude, my dear dude exploded. You should probably like point out a building first. Okay. Point out a building. Yeah, like that building. And now what? Ah, oh, right clicked in my head, my antlers stuck into the building. It's like, yeah, it's like a grapple ability. Like Goat Simulator's tongue. Yeah, Goat Simulator's tongue, yes. Meow. <laughs> oh. Uh, I, I'm too I far recommend away. you shouldn't hit the koala. <laughs> it is very much an aggressive being. How do I get to it? How do I get. Oh my gosh. What is going on right now? Unity engine shenanigans. Ragdoll absolute physics break. Yeah. You can also drive oh, cars. I adjust camera distance. This is what I needed. You can also drive cars. Okay, well, I'm gonna drive a car. So, what am I doing? I'm trying to aggravate the thing you told me not to aggravate. Probably need to, like, I don't know, hit it. Okay, you ain't get the koala. Okay. And you died. <laughs> Press escape. No, oh, his laser eyes. What a bunch of shit. Okay. So last time this was a cop here, and now it's just a human person. No, it's still a cop. Okay. Oh, what have I done? You grabbed him. How did I grab him? If you dash at him, you, you grab him. <laughs> I Let's missed. go drop the car. Okay. I hit F on the car? Yeah. Oh, Jesus, what happened? I have no idea what's going on. Okay, so now I'm a stuffed deer in the windshield. <laughs> this feels like shit. You know I, that. I know. This this car drives so terrible. And there's no actual place people to, like, reprimand me or stop this. Well, I mean, if you cause enough chaos, you could, that could probably happen. Does it happen, though? Do you get, like, five stars in GTA? I mean, you get, like, a... a a destruction great system. Oh, How lame. I was gonna make a loopy de loop. Now it's less lame. Yes, that now was... <laughs> never mind, now it's even lamer. That was, yeah, for a second there it was even less lame, and now it's back to lame. <laughs> okay, what else to do in a car? I mean, you could drift. On the water. Okay, so I can get on the water. How to drift? With space? You can basically just like press A and D and you. Yeah. I don't know. You go fast in cars. Is this a fuselage to a submarine? No, Helicopter. Think... It's a plane. Yeah. And it's a gun in there. Equip the gun. <laughs> but we should go inside the police station. Okay, where's it at? Right there. Is there is there a reason why it starts you off right next to the police station? Probably. Is that the reason why there was a police uh, police person at the spawn point, oh. right by the water? Okay, what do I do? You should probably go left into the police station. Uh, okay. Into that part of the police station. Yeah. How do I get in? What? Okay, back to doing what I'm supposed to be doing. There's guns everywhere. Hey, grab the pistol first. Okay. <laughs> He's John Wick. <laughs> so he's got... He's got two pistols. You should probably get the other guns, too. He's, yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Two guns. He's got two sets of two guns. How do I get into the building? Well, you don't. 
yet. Oh my gosh, then why did you tell me to come over here? Be because they're... you didn't grab the SMG though. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just more and more guns. <coughs> oh, this is about enough to make me um, have a little pass out attack. There's also a deer disaster level where if you, the more stuff you destroy, the 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 more it fills up, and the uh, see, you're already getting great amounts of deers. Uh oh, you got deer disaster level D. That mm. means the police, the animal police are coming. The animal police. Oh, they're quite they're literally sheep. animals. Why are they undulating like that? Because this is a Unity game. Oh god damn it. You should get the sheep. Oh. That's illegal, bruh. You even having more than two guns on you is illegal. <laughs> Not in America. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. What happened now? Oh, you got another deer's aster level. Another deer's aster level? Yeah. <laughs> the polar car. Oh, hey, it's grenades. Where? Right there. I like this. This is cool. Not really. It's stupid. <laughs> well, I mean, it's a cool kind of stupid. You it's know? a cool, it's a dumb kind of stupid that you kind of like. Hey, you defeat the cops again. Woohoo! Can you ever win? I mean, you almost defeated him. Oh, oh, you got me. Oh, you got him. Oh, man, that's a double kill. I love the ragdoll. Me too. Let's retry. Okay, retry. And now you're back at these after level E. Should probably get back, get the guns again. Oh, we need, like, guns is a big part of this game? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Oh, uh, shit. The movement sucks, because I don't know what to hit to do anything. <coughs> Walking is too slow, but sprinting is too fast and stupid. <laughs> you can also, you can also uh, talk to the NPCs. Oh, maybe I should have done that. Notice how this guy does not care that I just killed everybody. You can press up, you know. Uh, add someone. The up arrow. Okay. No, I didn't know that. Press up to deerify. Oh. He gets antlers and jo follows jo you. Joke's on him. Yeah, he runs like Naruto. Yeah, he, he, he runs like a... <laughs> he just absolutely tanked a car. <laughs> Slap this little bitty pony. Horse. Uh, well, I mean, compared to the size of the man, I would say that this is not a horse, but a pony. Small horse. It is a very tiny horse. I think this is slightly faster than walking. <laughs> this dude's just absolutely tanking cars. He's just, he's just wrecking them. He's rectifying them. I feel like I have no control over the horse right now. They should probably get off if you don't. If you I don't, don't like, like it. it. You can undeerify him if you want to. Okay. Yeah, that counts too. You could press escape. Just okay. Escape. Perfect. You gotta press up to undeerify him. I just want to kill him. You can't until you undeerify him. Holy shit. Can I just lose my wanted rating? <laughs> Can I hide? No. What if I ragdoll out like this, they'll think I'm already dead. No? No. No. Okay, so what else is there to do in this, uh, this very well-crafted Well, I mean, game? if you get Dio's Aster level A, you get to fight a boss. A different boss that isn't the giant koala. Okay. If you also regularly get to fly with your guns. 
there? What is that? I have no idea. <laughs> we probably shouldn't get close to it. We probably shouldn't attack it. Uh-oh. What have you done? I don't know, but I can't see. It's a coelacanth. Oh. You killed the giant fish. Nice. Huh. Sweet. It was the Dunkleosti- <laughs> Damn. Damn. Yeah, definitely undeerifying him would be cool. <laughs> should I? Yeah. Is that what I should do? Yeah, since you since you wanted to kill him. Okay, well, I press up on him. It, you gotta stare at him first. You gotta, oh my god, I'm gotta, gonna die! I gotta kill all these guys first. What the hell? You got hit by a car. What the hell? I've defeated the cops. Okay. So now now I gotta look at him and I gotta press the up key. There you go. Okay. Now he's on deer fight and he won't follow you. He can go. So I, I I like how you can just blow okay, up buildings. Katana. Where? Right there. Okay. You got a whole shift. Oh. Why? Oh, because then it's like this. Yeah. Uh-huh. You Let do, uh, damage, I guess. In an area. In an area. Yeah. yeah. How terrible. How stupid. How positively silly. Yeah. How not very helpful, really. How unethical. How hor horrid. Let go of it. <clears throat> I, need to, I need to get to my next deer. Deer disaster level. Deer disaster level. Okay. And now it's gonna be a rabbit. Sniper rabbit. Sniper rabbit. Ear walker. Ear walker? Also, apparently every deer disaster level up ups the instrumental by by one layer. You mean like the music? Yeah, it ups the ups the deer disaster music by one level. By one level. So it like adds another layer to the track so you know it's more intense. I probably agree with what you're saying, but I can't hear you. Cow! Cow! Well, take one of your ear mumps off of your ear just a little bit. And then turn the volume oh. down a little bit. Oh, you killed a hundred sheep. Fantastic. You got an achievement. It's got lasers. They got laser guns. You could... There's a chance that they might drop their laser gun. I'm such a fool. Hey, they dropped one of your... They dropped the <clears throat> Now I've got it. Now what? I guess you do more damage. Good. Periodically. Periodically. I've defeated the cops. <clears throat> yes, it seems it seems that, that that is the truth. It seems today that all you see is violence in movies. And, and sex on TV. <laughs> and sex with tuberculosis. Uh oh. Sex on TV. What's going on? Oh. It's hey, dog. it's a Shiba Inu. It's the Doge. It's a dog in a completely different area. Dog. Dog. <clears throat> okay. Is this a boss dog? You, you should probably. I should probably what? What should I do? I mean, it, it is a it is a boss dog. There's Where's... also a giant cow. Uh, let's go find the giant cow then. I mean, it's very convenient. It's right over there. Yeah, it's almost like I can see it. It if we shoot it, it changes colors. Or if you just hit it in any way, shape, and form, it changes colors. Also, if you ragdoll, yeah, uh, you can fire your guns and you can start flying. Ragdoll? How do you do that? R? You can just uh, do your uh, head. That grapple thing. There you go. Okay. Now my head is just. <laughs> it's just shooting uncontrollably, I feel. You should probably let go. What is going on? I don't know. You bugged out the game. You well, probably, I think. You should I, probably get up then. I think this game is meant to be bugged out. Oh, I'm gonna take it to the limit. Just flying away. <laughs> Where's the edge of the map? That's the edge of the map. Let's crash the game. 
We're gonna hit the end of the skybox. And you hit, you, you hit the, the top of the map. I don't think I did. Did I? Yeah, I think so. I think you hit the top of the map. <laughs> Definitely hitting some Oh, I'm hitting, I'm hitting the edges. So what if I let go at this point? I mean, you fall. Straight into the, straight into the boss arena. Oh, what a, what an epic way to fucking handle this. This is great. I like it. I'm raining hellfire down on the doge. I mean, you gotta enter the arena to truly fight the dog. Well, I'm trying to. How do I how do I do it in faster than when I'm doing it? Oh. Oh. By the way, this boss fight is very tough. Uh, well, I think I'm ready. I think I've trained. <clears throat> I believe that, uh, you know, you prepared me long and hard like those 80s movies where they do montages. Oh my gosh, it's like uh, Voltron. <laughs> Doggo. Doggo, the boss. You have to take out one of the cheap legs. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll, I aim for the right. sheep and then Now the you can face. attack the police cars. Oh, okay. So it's like a multi-stage. And, and then you hit can, the weak points. And then, yeah. You can take out one of the legs again. Okay. And you have to jump on the deer button. Well, I'm trying to get... I'm trying to back up a little bit. I guess I gotta shoot the other one? I mean, I don't know what I'm shooting right now. I gotta jump on the deer button? What yeah, on the police car. Oh. I'm trying. I don't know what I'm doing. I feel like I have messed up. I have done messed up now. Oh. Do I have to hit it with my horn? I mean, you gotta sit on it for a, a, a second. Oh no. Okay. How about this? I did it. it. It blows off one of the... yeah. It blew it. I'm really good at blowing stuff. There you are. Okay. Say so. I mean, I, I think you get more than... You, you technically have, like, six parts. Technically, six... six, like, pieces. Okay. <laughs> After this phase, he just starts wildly running. You can probably kill him before he gets you. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm trying to... Ah, uh, I forgot about running. I need to run. Where'd you go? I uh, don't know. Probably out of the arena. Oh, he's right there. Get him. Oh, no! Oh, he's on me. How do I get away from him? Just gun him down. Okay. I'm not hitting. I've defeated the corpse. And now what? Oh. Uh, you ragdolled. Oh yeah, but you see that little, like, uh... What? Oh, uh, just out of the arena? Um, just out of the arena. Need the arena. Through the entrance. Well, okay. Through the entrance. Katana. Now what? I mean, you can get a deer mech. Where? Uh, to the left. To the left. To the left. Left a little bit more. Left a little bit more. Yeah, that place right there. That island. That small little island. Who's that over there? I don't know. Okay. Uh, am I supposed to be on one of these buttons? Yeah. See, there's a rhino, so that's one of the buttons. Okay. And you have to get some sort of, like, cow or something, and then yourself. Oh, well, that ain't gonna happen. <clears throat> Ever tried getting the Dumfrey-looking fellow? The Dumfrey? What does that mean? That the flying, flying elephants you saw. Oh, maybe I do need to do that. It's the, it's the train. <laughs> it's the train I blew up earlier. 
Okay. Yeah, he periodically flies over the skyscraper. Okay. I think I'm about done. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So let's... Uh, I'm just going to uh, <laughs> go ahead and read the words of the developer. Yeah. You feel like doing that with me or... Sure. As you guys know, a Let's Try Out video is a part Let's Play. There's going to be some commentary in here, a part tutorial you learn as I learn as I play the game, and part first impressions, because a lot of these games I've never played before. And uh, you get to go through, step through all the problems that I step through, and, and hopefully we come out the other side learning a little bit. And kind of a part review, because I try to rehash a little bit of my opinions at the end of the piece. After we read the words of the developer, we can try to make a decision whether they're shoveling us a load of bullshit or if they're spot on honest and it seems to make a lot of sense with what they're trying to, uh, the product that they're trying to produce. And if you want to spend your hard earned money on it, because at the end of the day, I'm trying to give you an honest presentation of the first 30 minutes or so of a video game really is. That way we can make a sound judgment on it. So let's read the words of the developer. To put it simply, Deer Simulator is a slow-life town destruction game. You spend your days enjoying nice, relaxed frolic here and there with other animals around the town, or you can choose to relieve some stress and absolutely destroy the town and everything in it. So far, the reviews are mostly positive, almost 3,000 reviews since its uh, release date in 2001. And this 2021? Is... Yeah, Jesus, 2021. Thanks. I wonder how many times I've done that in previous videos where I just absolutely said a stupid-ass number and... I didn't have you here to help me. Yeah. Playism. And give your games. Developed, give your games, and published by Playism. Uh, this is an open world sandbox physics, funny, cute, goofy exploration single player game. And currently on Steam right now, it's $15. If you're interested in this sort of stuff. Deer Simulator, your average everyday deer. Like uh, the deer. <laughs> Dear Bluff of Lux about this game. Okay, so another game. There's a game claimed to be made available on Steam, which you take on the role of a main character, a deer, run around town, freely taking advantage of, of a man character's deer specific attributes, such as striking neck and stubby antlers. Uh, it's just the game description to match through every day. Life in an unassuming town to unleash the true power of the deer. Yeah, so this is Deer Simulator, uh, De Deer Simulator, uh, very much like Goat Simulator. And that's it. That's all I got. Say all bye. Right. Bye bye. Say bye, everybody. Goodbye. See ya. Thanks for making it all the way to the end of the video. And since you're here, why don't you go ahead and leave a like on the video if you liked it. Dislike it if you disliked it. Sound off in the comments below about any other opinions that you might have. I appreciate you stopping by. Subscribe for future content. Share my video with a friend if you can. It helps me out a whole lot. This is Proto Dead saying I'll see you in the future.